Hi, uh, it's been a while since I um, last uploaded a video on the channel. Um, yeah, last few more, last couple of months I got a bit busy with um, some other stuff. Now um, I'm up to um, a new project. Uh, to be honest, it's not a project, it's just uh, getting my car fixed. Um, so what happened is um, my daily driver, which is um, that white Land Rover there, um, just gave up on me. Um, it, uh, it just um, developed a coolant leak from the block, pretty unusual for these cars. Uh, it just um, uh, developed a hole on the side of the block, not a wash plug, it just a um, hole in the block. So that's uh, beyond fixing. Um, so I'm trying to get this one uh, up and running so I can use this one. Uh, with this, we had a blown head gasket, so I just uh, took the head off to replace the head gasket. And uh, I, when I had a look at the, uh, the the bores, they're pretty worn. So I thought there's no point um, putting a new head gasket onto this block. So I bought a block, uh, and then I'm just trying to rebuild that engine outside and then get this one out put the uh, the other one back in so that's the plan so I got the block uh, decked uh, machine and got the head machined um, everything's ready to go now so I already put the uh, put new main bearings and uh, I got the the pistons out here so they're gonna go with new main bearing, uh, new beacon bearings got the crank there um, and head is over here which has been skimmed and uh, all the uh, stem seals done and well uh, seats been uh, done so now it's the time to reassemble everything so I got the uh, standard uh, rings the uh, ring set for this because there's nothing much wrong with the pistons. There's nothing wrong at all with the pistons. Mm -hmm. They're pretty good They're with, within the specs. And um, the, uh, the crank um, is um, still in really good shape, standard journals. So I just got a new uh, standard size main bearing set. So that's gonna go with this, can uh, this crank. Um, and uh, I got a new standard um, main bearing set to go with this and the begin bearing set so the, they're both standards um, the bores are pretty good on this block there's nothing uh, wrong with this one there's um, very minimal uh, wear uh, so I just decided to um, go with a standard ring set so that will that will do it uh, because um, if there's no need to uh, rebore it I don't want to do it because workshop manual says don't do it but I know people, I have done it before as well, you can do it, but if it doesn't need it, I don't want to do it. So I just leave it as it is, because this one's pretty good. Um, so I already um, uh, get the uh, the rings. There's nothing much to do on these, because they are standard size. Um, just check the gap. They're all within specs. Um, good quality rings, actually. Um, German brand, I think. Yeah, German brand. Uh, and we got some good quality um, main bearings, uh, the King bearings, they're pretty good, for, they're well known for uh, TD5 uh, bearings. So I'm going to do that and put this thing back together and hopefully get it back in the car by next week, that's the plan anyways, um, and get it up and running. So uh, we'll do another video maybe halfway down or when 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 the car's running somewhere in between maybe uh, and then um, I'll see you with that video then thank you